Hello, I'm Entrelissim and welcome back to From the Depths. I've moved our satellites up. We can now see a lot more of the terrain than we used to be able to. Where are you moving to? You should be moving to here, right? Yes. And this satellite here is now on station, which means we can see their base. Oh, I'm looking forward to going to their base. So much. You seem to be taking a long time. Top speed 6. Top speed 26. Okay, that's why you're taking a long time. For some reason, you've got much less speed. What about you guys? Three, yeah. Well, I'm guessing it's because you experienced your speed because I took you up, whereas you never experienced your own speed, so you're not sure how fast you are. Uh, right. We're going to take out this 81. And we're going to do it with our new bomber thing, I think. And then we'll start cracking out the resource zones because we're right next to two resource zones and then they're like home base. So... Yeah, they're gonna chase down our helicopters. That's fine, we'll have to take you out separately. Hi! Ow, that was painful. Battle size. Seems acceptable. Now make sure my fighters are spread out rather than spawning on top of each other, which they are want to do. Begin battle. I have to pity the enemy right now. I mean, I would, but I'm not that kind of person. I don't pity. They have some aircraft, but they're not going to last long. Ah, oh, the air wing coming in. I, there's nothing quite so glorious. Hits already. One of ours has gone up, but that's probably from friendly fire rather than anything else. The bomb has already gone overhead. Second wave of missiles inbound from the bomber, because these ones aren't KKV, so they don't go quite as fast. Though they were out of range. Shame. Okay. That's a Sandman coming in for an attack. Oh, hello there. Not a particularly good craft. The helicopters are mobbing that arrow that went down. Ha oh, I almost, I almost pity the arrow. Almost. Almost. Fighters coming back in. Hitting the arrow. KKV EMP warheads. And they've killed the AI. The AI on that one's dead. That's it. That salmon is still on its way. I, you're terrible. The battle is over. We should make a bet at the helicopter at some stage. Win. Okay. I'm going to pull all. Uh, I'm going to check. Yeah, you've taken some damage over there. And you, and you. Yes! Right, 50,000 blocks. I can't have that many blocks in battle. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to bring it down to 25,000. Uh, maybe we could go to 30. Probably not the lure. I'm going to take it to 20, 27 ish. Right. The Ladius, the Fowlers, that, that seems like a really good uh, combination. I want my fighters to at least be split apart slightly. And now I'd like to begin the battle. This is going to be one hell of a battle. Okay. Detaching camera. Oh, wow. Okay. Didn't realize that was quite so hard of a hill. I should have realized. More like a mountain, really. Our helicopters are just going to fly straight into the side of that. Fine, I've come to terms with that. Our fighters are just... Our helicopters are just going to fly straight into the side of it and die. 
Oh, hello. Those guys are missile spamming. That's the only thing that can defeat us. They've killed themselves by the look of it. This might actually be painful for the bomber. Yep. That's going to hit. Ow. Okay, I need to do some quick repairs. We have killed a load of them. We're taking some serious damage ourselves. Look at that. Like, our engines out. Our actual, you know, fuel drinking engines are out. We're repairing as fast as we can, which is pretty fast. Oh, if you crash, or are you just hanging? Hanging. Okay, good. Well, not good, but better. The helicopters are engaging. Good helicopters. You need to distract. How's our weapon systems? We've still got the port weapon system. Ow, ow, ow. Oh. If we can get our engines back up, we should be good. Yes! One engine, which means we'll go in circles, but at least it means we'll be hard to hit. But my god, that retaliator has found so many missiles. Fair play to it. Oh god, don't hit the mountain. We might end up hitting the mountain. Repairing as fast as we can. We've done a pretty good job. That's why I put a lot of my points into repair. Like, most of my points are in repair. Like, 90-something worth of points. Okay, second engine is actually getting worked on now. Oh. Okay. We've taken some losses. Uh, both of our fighters are still going, which is good. Oh. Oh. Oh, close. Ooh, we just took a couple of hits ourselves. Uh, our engine's out again. Damn. These guys are tough. And we've got both of our engines up. Huzzah! A little bit of repairing. Much appreciated. We've hit space, which means we're slowing down. If we could not hit space, that would be good. Uh, Anti-missile systems firing, although it's not going to get much power. Okay, how are you doing? Missile systems are still fairly damaged, but at least you're capable of flying. There's a lot more enemies to fight, so you need to be, you know, fully in service. Come on, bomber. You got this. You got this. I believe in you. Wish that was kind of more in-game music right now. Doesn't seem to be any. Ooh, we killed something. We've killed all the small things by the look of it. Uh, actually, a couple of those are mine. But whatever. We're coming for, for a bombing run on the Retaliate. We don't have much ordnance to drop, but fine. Drop what you can. And those are hits. Good, good. Keep those hits up. Right, where'd the bomber go? Directly above. Still reloading, re repairing. That's cool. Okay, so what are you like? Let's look at you. Big, lots of spikes, tough, giant capital ship. With a glass ceiling here, I could totally jump into the cockpit and board it, and I would totally miss. But it's got a lot of anti missile missiles, so, you know, it's not stupid. Those missiles there are actually anti-missile missiles. You can tell by their ridiculously short length and their maneuverability and the way they're flying. Right, how much are we up to now on our ordnance? We're still working to get one side fully built, but that's a lot closer than it used to be. Actually, no, is it fully built? We've actually stuck on the other side. I don't think it's quite... No, it, yeah, it's fully built. Huh. And it's reloaded. Sweet! Okay, this means we've got a full side, which is 10 KKVs, 13 normal missiles. Oh, God! I only just repaired that. Yeah. That's frustrating, but what can you do?
Seriously, if we're moving faster, there's going to be an issue. Yes, 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 move faster. That's it. Nice, right. That looks like some sort of, almost like an anti-aircraft gun boat. It's fast. Some of our missiles are targeting it. Hello. Good. Not sure exactly where the rest of our missiles have gone to. I'm not even sure where the retaliator is anymore. It's over there. Okay. Ooh. Hello. Oh, it's a little ditty flyer. This thing looks pretty cool. I like you. Also, stop getting yourself caught in space, bomber. Why are you doing this? You're actually a fairly capable bomber. You've just decided to stall out in space. Stop. You know what? I'm taking control. Okay, there goes a wing. Right. Bring the nose down. Bring the nose down. Right, we need to have the other engine online because currently we've got an engine that's offline. Right, how are we doing with these? Looks like we're targeting the small flyer, which I very much appreciate because that small flyer is actually really annoying. Okay, it's down. It's still in the game. Bomber needs to repair the entire wing. Come on. Also, stop being so ridiculously high up. It, look, the bombers literally have an AI telling them to be at, like, uh, altitude of 300. But they always choose to go to 500. I'm really not sure what it is about the in-game aerial AI that just does that. Too damaged. Ooh, what was that? Was it a fighter? No, it was a heli. Okay. Are we repaired yet? Almost. Good deal of repairing is going on. We'll have a lot more control back once we've got the uh, the roll of thrusters on this wing done. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! Oh, you're just coming in to repair. Hey, thanks for the help. This is appreciated. I thought that was going to end very badly. I think what I should do is probably take a little bit of control. And get nice and low. Fly directly over the retaliator. There we go. Right, we're flying 100. Hundred and seventy. There we go. This is unleashed. Going in. Yeehaw! Okay, AI take over. And here are our missiles coming in. Good hits. Second wave, non KKVs, big explosions and stuff. Yep, good damage. I'm suspecting they've got EMP shielding as well, but we'll overcome that eventually. See what happens when I fly so much better. Is that heli just going to stand there and not do anything? Look, the bomb has got itself caught in space again. Yeah, we're in altitude 500 again. We shouldn't be. We really shouldn't be. You've got, literally, you've got orders not to be at this height. And we're actually getting hit now. We're taking hits because you've gone to that height. Stop it. It's ridiculous. You can actually outrun most missiles. We've lost an engine. Which I now have to rebuild. And I have to fly on one engine, which is not particularly beneficial to my flying skills. I think I just got hit by one of my own missiles. 
Yes, there we go. We've got second engine online. Just got to roll now. Okay. Roll it over. Roll it over. We're still getting significantly more power from one engine and not the other. Because we're yawing quite badly. Okay, bring around. Bring around. And bring the altitude down a fair bit as well. Enemy boat, dead ahead. Firing missiles. Nice. Good hits. Okay, and second. That's not a lot of missiles in the second row, but okay. Its ability to damage us has been severely depleted. That was probably a fighter. Yeah, those feel like fighter missiles because they come in threes. There we go, yeah. And the bomber has got stuck in space again. Seriously. Why? Good attack run. Eject, eject, eject. Firing. Missing, okay. Firing. Um. Well, I hit my target. Jump. Okay. Right. Minigun time. I don't think I can really use uh, explosives inside here. I'm going to be looking for any AIs. I'm going to go down below decks. This is incredibly dangerous. I'm probably going to end up dead. Engine. Destroying the engine. Good idea. Too damaged. Sustained by repairs. Oh, I need to go through that. Um, backing away. Again. Right, what's in here? Oh, it's... Oh, it's uh, like little missionary area. Like where they preach and stuff. Like a church. Oh, this is cool. Ammo stockpile. I'm pretty sure we can just, just, just rely on this place being dead. I'm gonna just minigun that over there because I can see some ammo. There we go. Sustained by repairs still. I'm gonna have to find the AI. Be around it somewhere. I was asking for that. You know, I understand. Where am I spawning? Am I spawning on top of the enemy? There is an enemy over here. Oh, and it's coming straight for me. Get out of my way, piece of... Ah! If only my drop pod hadn't been in my way. Right, I don't need to spawn here. I need to spawn over here. Seriously, let me select you. Oh, there we go. Too damaged. Doesn't look like it's sustained my repairs anymore. If only we knew where the AI were. In its defense, it's probably got a fair few AI. Now, my only hope is that on its despawn, we'll actually uh, despawn an AI, and then I'll be like, Oh, there's no AI. You're mine. 
It's unlikely. That said, it's a lovely design. Oh crap! Kudos to the to the creator. It's a lovely design. Oh, hi there. You're not me. I'm me. Why are you spawning like that as a helibot? Huh. No, no, it's going. It's going. It's mine! Huzzah! No, stop shooting it! It's mine! Stop! No! Oh. Oh, well. Okay. And I guess since the battle is probably going to go on for a little bit longer, or is that it? Is that it? I was thinking that we might have to do this in two parts, but no, no, it looks like we might have finished the battle. Ooh! Ooh, hello. Something over here that's shooting. A flagellator. <gasps> hello. You know that resource gathering thing. I would like to... Watch this. Yes! Ammo went up. Two damaged. That's it. One pass. One pass. Nothing else was needed. Oh, how glorious. How very glorious. And we've gone to space again. This time, at least, you know, there was a mountain range in the way. Turn. Turn better. You might actually hit this. It looks like a giant lump of lava, but it's bumpy, which is odd. Oh, we won. Huzzah! Well, thank you very much for watching. We managed to take out a very large section of the map there. We did piss off this guy, which is fine. Um, I think next time we'll take out this section. Probably with some, I don't know, the problem is with the terrain here, it doesn't really benefit our subs. But maybe we should. We'll launch a sub in here. Storage cell. Vendants. Yeah, we'll put the Vendants in here. Move the storage cell up to here. You guys are my captured, so you can come back here to be, you know, put into my collection fleet. What about you guys? What are you? Uh, my backup fleets. I'll put you somewhere on the front lines. The Doodle Hog. Just follow around. The Duranku class. Right. Well, if you enjoyed this episode, please like, not subscribe, please consider subscribing. We will wipe out the White Flayers pretty shortly. I don't think there's much that can withstand our might right now. We're, do we're in a pretty good position. We're in a pretty good position. My tea is cold. I did make it an hour ago. All right. But if you've liked me, like, not subscribe, please consider subscribing. Have I said that before? I don't know. I was too busy enjoying destroying the enemy. Ah. Uh, however, now we've got several resource things, I will need to make a, uh, a new resource ship. I think we'll do it maybe after we beat the White Flares, because right now we have the ability to beat them. So might as well beat them and then discuss what we're going to do with all the ridiculous amounts of resources we have. Actually, that's it. We've only got one million mel. That's not a lot. But anyway, until next time. Pardon me. Until next time, stay shiny.